Yo, this is Lordship. And um, I'm going to try something different. This show is pre recorded. This is not live, it is pre recorded. And I just want to talk about, probably talk about this Saudi royal family. You know, just, you know, like the money stuff. And um, I'm just going to go for the flow. I'm going to keep it short. I'm going to try to send this file to myself and then upload it at my discretion. A lot of things been going on in the sector of YouTube. You know what sector I'm talking about. And um, I have no opinion and no comment. And that's pretty much how I've been from the giddy up. It, you know, it has nothing to do with me. I have my opinion. You know, life is short. People like to waste time on stuff that really don't affect them. And they could be doing something productive, but it has nothing to do with me. So anyway, let's run this test. This show is being pre-recorded and it's not in front of an audience using OBS Studio. Man, I don't think they heard you. Won't you tell them what your name is? Won't you tell them what your name is? Won't you tell them what your name is? Lordship in the building. Um, let's get some of this graphics out the way. Now, the Saudis were five times more than Elon Musk and Bill Gates combined. The Saudi royal family leads a life so luxurious that even billionaires cannot imagine. And their mega yacht has a $45 million painting on it. You know, it's too quiet. So I'm going to put one of my little backing tracks, one of my little dime a dozen backing tracks I make for different occasions. Let's see. They drive gold-plated supercars and their palaces have thousands of rooms, okay? Thousands of rooms. I know one boxer, one Negro, Boxer had um, about 48 rooms in his house. Um, unfortunately, I don't think he was able to hold on to it. But yeah, Mega Yacht, which is a term I've never heard of before, <laughs> has a... Look, some people yachts cost several million, okay? This is a Mega Yacht with a painting that costs 450 million. So, this is all interesting. Uh, like, people don't have nothing to do. How can you have so much money 
that you don't know what to do with it. You know? So much money. It's strange. But, you know, I probably would enjoy it myself as well. So, you know, the house of Saud has been um, the ruling dynasty of Saudi Arabia since the um, country was established in 1952. Actually, 1932, you know, but, you know, that was a long time ago, so, but I think it was 1932 for sure. Uh, over time, the uh, Saudi royal family has verified itself as one of the world's wealthiest and most powerful families, okay? And if, you know what? I think they pay for every presidential uh, memorial or, or burial, you know what I'm saying? Like the funeral in the, in the presidential library. I think they do that as a gift to the United States. They, they pay for every deceased presidential funeral and usually it's on the site of their dedicated presidential library something like that something like that you know what I'm talking about but uh, their vast never ending wealth resources are made conspicuously owing to their luxurious lifestyle and um as expected from the worlds, they travel donning the priceless label with large entourages, like a thousand people, okay? And they, I mean, like a thousand butlers, okay? Now, um, but they stay in the high end hotels. And if there ever could be a perfect picture, of immense wealth and power, it would star a Saudi royal. You know, and let's take a closer look at the benefits of being incredibly rich. So the next time his lordship go live, I probably won't have this up. I'm gonna have to look for this website, but um, basically it's called Luxury Launches, okay? And um, the pictures are amazing. These, these guys, it's rich. It's late. I don't want to be up too late. This is basically a test, but I'll tell you one thing. <laughs> these motherfuckers is rich. Um, the house of Saud comp comprises of 15,000 people. Now, what's no noteworthy is only 2,000 possess the majority of the wealth which is estimated to be around 1.4 trillion and even fewer play after roles in po political or politics and government and to put things in perspective the house of Saud is a whopping 16 times richer than the British royal which is worth 88 billion so let me say that again these guys are a whopping 16 times richer than the British royal family, which is worth only a mere 88 billion. So I just want to leave you with that, folks. All right. I didn't want to get all Hollywood with you, you know. I'm going to just let you hold on to that right there, okay? Peace and hair grease.